So here we have a, a Porsche Carrera S. This is a, a 911-993. This is an R grade. And we'll just try and get a shot of the auction sheet. RB, interior B. You can see on the auction diagram there, we've got an A4 scratch along the bottom. We've got some W paint traces around the car. Uh, it also says about um, some oil leaking and um, some inner panel dents. So we know also from another auction that this car's had the, the front bonnet changed. And if I run my hand along here, it is a little bit out of line. That center is a lot thinner than down here. And this here is high. And likewise, that bonnet there is high. So it's not the best job. I don't know if we're gonna get a, you might see that's a little bit high along there particularly compared to the other side. Um, we'll have a look inside the bonnet. I don't think this is the best repair job I've seen. Um, I don't know if this is going to come out too well, but inside there, maybe it's better from this side. You can see some pretty, pretty rough repair marks. Likewise on the other side, um, we can see the repair marks at the front. They gave it an A4 along the front for that scratch. I don't really think it's that bad. Except for an A4 that is. You see, they also say there's some panel dents underneath. You can see just behind that scratch, the panels dint it up a little bit so it's hit a gutter. So this one the bods the bonnet is falling down the so you can see down here at the front once again it's a pretty rough repair job. I've got a head torch on so that's the light. Over here you can see the difference in paint colour. There's a slight, very slight bend or dent there. And that's in a core support. And that's why it's an R grade. You can see also up here there's a little bit of bodywork. The painting is um, not the best. Likewise on the other side. That's not too bad. So it's obviously been hit over on the left hand side of the car more. Um, I don't know if it's going to come out. There is a little bit of a wave on the front. The front bumper is a little bit more wavy than the others. So they've said there's been some W spray resprays along the side of the car, and you can see some. We've got some repair traces of that just along here. Once again, I think that's a pretty rough, rough job. Try and get a still shot of that. Inside the car is quite nice. Um, the other thing is there's a little bit of very small waving. I don't know if it's going to come out with a reflection. If I run the camera there just in the light you might be able to see it. Bit of a rough spray job up the top there. Now the other thing is along here, you can see, it's going to come out in the little camera, there is a line, so it's been sprayed and they haven't sprayed all the way over the corners there, so we've got a, a paint mark along there, don't know if that's coming out, the other side is not, not as bad. Um, they say this one's got an oil leak. And the car, there's no drops on the ground, 
so it's very small and you can probably if I shine the head torch up there you might be able to see what sort of leaks they have the seriousness of it I mean it's hard to tell without really pulling the car up but it's not moist underneath but you can see inside the engine it's it is moist and wet so this car was unsold uh, about a month or two ago for 2.3 million so there you have it thanks for watching